For our cowl, we'll be using three balloons. This is actually a blush heart. You can use white or ivory, ivory silk, whatever color you like. Now I've inflated it until the lobes are just starting to round out. So it's just a little more than round. You can see where it's bulging. These are the, what will be the lobes? That will be the nozzles, or the, the, the nostrils later on our cow's muzzle. We've got a white 160, inflated leaving about a six to seven inch tail. And then I've got a mocha brown 260, also leaving about oh, five and a half inch tail. We're gonna start with our mocha. What we're gonna do is make about a two and a, two and a half inch bubble into a fold twist. Twist the nozzle around so that you've got a secured fold twist. And then repeat it again, the same size. So you've got two fold twists. Now we're gonna come up and make about an inch to an inch and a half bubble. A little small half inch bubble. Make that into a pinch twist. And then another bubble the same size as this one coming back down. And twist that into the base there where those two fold twists are. And I'll turn it so that your two fold twists are on either side. This will be the top of our head in a moment. Now we're gonna make about a one inch bubble for our neck. A little small half inch bubble, make that into a pinch twist. And then two small bubbles, about an inch and a half each for our front legs. Secure that back end where that pinch twist is. Now we're gonna make about a two inch bubble for our body. Another, about a three quarter inch bubble, made into a pinch twist. And then we're going to take that pinch twist and split it into two smaller bubbles. Now we'll need two small back legs about the same size as our front legs. Bring them back up into that split pinch twist there. Let's secure that around. We'll pop our excess off and secure that in there. I'll just check that into the legs. And there's the body of our cow. Now we're going to take our blush heart, take the muzzle, the nozzle end, and in the middle of these two fold twists, you want to take and pull that knot up in there. Pull it pretty tight so it pulls the heart up against it. And that will be our muzzle. It gives him an extra large muzzle, makes him very cute. Now we're going to take our 160, make about a five to six inch bubble. This will be one of his horns. Twist it in around that ear twist. Now we're going to want to go down along the front of these two bubbles and twist into the base of that heart. And make sure you push with your thumb way down in there. Go around one of the fold twists to secure it. And then we're going to come back out the other side and go back up to that top ear twist again. Make our two eyes. Go around the top to secure it a time or two. Now you want to take and make another bubble the same size. So we have two horns the same size. Pop the excess off. Hang on to that. We'll need that in a moment. Secure this other horn. Now I'll trim that up a little bit. And you can shape your horns however you like. And now, with that excess white that we had, we want to pull a little bubble on the end of that and then tie off about three or so inches up from it. This will be our tail. Trim the excess off, leaving just a little bit, maybe a quarter inch there. Enough to come up and twist, twist around the back end of this split pinch twist we have on the back. And with that split pinch twist, you can take that tail and pull it up between them. And it'll now stand up so that his tail will stick up like that. Just a little added cute effect. Take your muzzle, turn it around to the front. Some eyes. And then where the two lobes for the heart are uninflated, you'll see some dark spots there. Draw a little half circle over the top of those for his nostrils. And there's his mouth. And there we have our little cute cow.